Hey guys, how are you? It's Courtney Hall, Editor-in-Chief of Bella Magazine, here with Chief Brand Strategist Daniel Hall. Buonasera. <laughs> We've missed you guys over the past couple weeks, but we're so excited to be back in Times Square, uh, Star Shop Studios, for our weekly Facebook Live for Bella TV. That's right. We're back. We're, we're back. Here. We're back in New York. Well, I'm sure, as most of you know, Dan and I actually were in LA for about a week, um, hosting our summer issue cover party. I have the hard copy right here with oh, Camilla West. Alves. West Coast. Dave, be quiet. I mean, oh my gosh, help me. Um, with Camilla Alves, and we just had an amazing party last Friday night at Soft Hotel in Beverly Hills, our absolute favorite hotel out there. And uh, it was a star-studded event. It was pretty fabulous, right, Dave? Yeah, it was awesome. Great crowd, a lot of energy. People were fantastic. Uh, Camilla was amazing and loved her. I well, you know what it is? She's just like super down to earth and nice. And that honestly is what I love about um, a lot of these bigger names is that they tend to be more down to earth and just super nice and super grateful for everything. And yeah. she showed up and was like the A-list star that we knew she would be. I mean, D, the red carpet. You know, we do the red carpets a lot. I mean, you know, all the Bella parties. But nothing was like her. When Camilla stepped on, there were like hundreds of flash bulbs going right. off. I've never seen anything like that. Right? That was really the first time for that. I she loved was amazing. it. She was fantastic. She <laughs> worked the crowd. She walked around. She I'm like, I loved it. Yeah. I felt like I was a star myself that night. I was just kidding. <laughs> you are. You definitely <laughs> Be quiet. Were. No, I'm just kidding. You know, but oh, wait. Here we are. Here we are. Here we go. There's so let's jump right into the shot. Yes. Right? So this was uh, Camilla, Dan, and myself on the red carpet last week. And uh, mm. I mean, Camilla looked just like top notch. She was wearing like a couture dress. She just knocked it out of the ballpark. She is just, Fantastic. she's amazing. And I was wearing actually a dress that I picked up actually on the Upper East Side at Kyle by Aileen too. Love that store. How much am I, am I a fan? <laughs> actually, it's owned by Carl Richards, who's a housewife of Beverly Hills. And it was my first time in there and I saw that dress and I was like, you're mine. So I took it and I wore it to LA and I loved it. So yay for Kyle by awesome. Aileen too. Yes, it was amazing. So speaking of the LA party, I know that Mindy and Paula recapped everything for us last week, all the red carpet fashion. And I must say, LA was rocking the fashion last week. I yeah. was very happily surprised. I thought everyone looked amazing. They were ready to go out and they had amazing looks. Yeah. Um, what was the, your favorite, I guess, part of the party or your favorite guest at the party? I mean, there I were a lot of good people. There. Yeah, there were a lot of good people. Yeah. I loved it. Yeah, Camilla was fantastic. I love how she really talked with the guests, worked the crowd a little bit. That yeah. was a lot of fun, so I like that. I and we, you know, probably one of the biggest, we were huge Dallas fans way back in the day. And then even the show Dallas. The show Dallas. Old school. That's yes. Right. And um, the remake. Which oh, was on for a couple of years. That's right. It was huge. So what are you saying, Linda Gray? I mean, probably. Probably. She I came. Mean, she, yeah. It was pretty awesome, right? Yeah. yeah. Not my favorite, but Whoa. I was Okay, here we go. <laughs> so all right, you brought Speaking this picture. Of Linda you brought Gray, <laughs> yes. We're like hardcore Dallas fans, right? Yeah, yeah. And so much that we actually did a photo shoot in Dallas. With and Steph uh, Holman, who that's we right, love. Steph Holman, that's right. And what did we do? We went to the ranch. Well, right? we, I was like, you know what? How can you be in Dallas and be 40 minutes from South Fork, the actual South Fork, and not try to go ride the horses there? <laughs> so the Bella team, it was actually Phil, who's our creative director, myself, Dan, Mindy, and Paula, and we rode on a <laughs> South Fork. And it was really, honestly, hysterical that and amazing. Fun. And I told Linda about that and told her the whole story. And, and she loved it. She loved it. She, she was, was so, like, she was impressed yeah. that we were such big fans. And that was nice to see that she appreciated that. That's right. And you know what is uh, so amazing is we were so impress impressed by her and had such a good conversation that we are actually featuring her in um, an upcoming issue of the magazine. So stay tuned. You're going to hear all amazing Linda Gray news. That's right. No, she's awesome, and I'm excited for that. That's and right. And this is so probably the only picture you'll ever see me on horseback, so take it all in right now, right? <laughs> <laughs> all right, good. Say, yeah. So yeah, so that was good. So LA, so we did that. And one more thing I want to mention, which was kind of a highlight of our LA trip, was um, lunch with Jose Ebert. Yeah. Jose Bear, I mean, everyone knows him, world famous, iconic hairstylist. Um, his flagship store is in Beverly Hills, right off Rodeo, and uh, I mean, it is fabulous. Yeah, and so uh, he's the nicest man, and he actually um, took Dan and I on a tour of his beautiful space and then brought us to a very, like, 
local exclusive uh, eatery for lunch, mm -hmm. and uh, it was awesome. And he actually helped us name one of the new pages in the magazine. It was his idea. Well, yeah. it was a collective idea, but he named it, and I love it. Yeah. And we're going to uh, start. For the dreamers. For the dreamers. For the dreamers, exactly. Because everyone has big dreams in life, and we want to um, highlight the practical living in NYC, but also uh, the luxury dreams, because we all have them, let's That's be right. honest. That's right. So we'll look for that in the coming pages of Bella of for the dreamers, and uh, it'll be some fabulous things to dream about. It'll, whoa, okay. <laughs> Sometimes I got them all right now. Okay, well, speaking of dreams and uh, luxurious dreams, Dan, what issue literally came in today? That's right. Fresh came in today, press. first copy. Here we go. Yes. First issue, Hampton's issue. Hampton's issue. Hampton's cover. I love the cover. It looks came so great. nice. cover looks yeah. great. Everything looks really, really awesome. The whole issue is fantastic, so I'm super excited. Yeah, no, it's awesome. And you know what? Like, the ladies here, all dressed in white, actually shot at Soft Patel, Beverly Hills, in the yep. same spot that we just had our cover party. And um, this is always, I think, our most fun issue every year because it's all about summer and it's about just like, you know, living the summer in New York City, Hamptons lifestyle. Yep. And uh, we always have the white party, as we mentioned, and that's coming up in four weeks. Four weeks. I'm going to tell you in a little bit on how to win some tickets to that event if you are interested. Yes. Well, of course. I mean, how could you not be interested? Well, it's it's a Bella White Party, the fifth annual White Party, mm -hmm. and, uh, and the cast of Girlfriend's Guide is going to be there. We have a ton of other uh, really awesome names who will be in attendance. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a super fun party, and we hope to see you there. That's right. Um, but my favorite part of the issue I have to talk about is Best of Bella. Um, yeah. I think that we have a screenshot of that, but actually that is something that we've done for the past, what, seven years, seven yes. summer issues, uh, seven Hamptons issues, yep. and our one of our best editors, Ginny Mascarella, actually every year, she compiles um, a list of her top 15 uh, places and things for the summer, and she does everything from like, Best restaurant to best, you know, best beach, best yep. boardwalk, best yeah, go, urban oasis, awesome. which is the Four Seasons, which of course is definitely an urban oasis I would like to visit. Yeah. Uh, best margarita, just everything, you know, best staycation with your pet. If you are a person who needs to bring the dogs, pick up a copy of Bella and we will give you the best spots to bring your dogs to NYC for your summer vacation. Anything about New York, your best pop off the mind? My best things about New York. Yeah, anything jump off that's like not in there, maybe just something random. <laughs> You're random, <laughs> how about that? No, um, you know what? I mean, obviously, my favorite things about um, New York are it's the greatest city in the world. Um, there's always action, it's always lively. No matter what time of day, there's something going on. Um, I love the fashion, I think it's second to none because everyone has their own style and it's amazing, I love it. And it's really, honestly, Funny. Yeah. I, I think it's so much like based around like neighborhoods. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like the style I feel in Soho, in our office space, is is very different than it was when we were downtown at Financial. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Out with the business suits, in with the artsy vibe. Yes. Right. I feel like a suit though. I still do. Like yes, suit. he loves suits. Like suits. Yes, he does. Well, you know what? I'm going to ask you your best of, because I saw that Jay actually wrote uh, best Italian restaurant since you are our local oh, Italian. Oh. Why don't you tell us? Yeah, the meatballs. <laughs> oh my God! Go. Okay. Why don't you tell me <laughs> what's your favorite Italian restaurant? Best of. Oh well, I, I mean, there's so many, really. I mean, I wouldn't say best. I just, you know, I'm really simple, so I'm really just like your regular basic, boring chicken and parm kind of guy. Chicken parm, <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> so anywhere, it doesn't matter. Pizza stand, <laughs> five star restaurant. Right. Well, pizza is probably my favorite food, actually. I have to say, if I had to pick a favorite, best of, I'd have to probably say pizza is like top of. of okay, but then where though? Oof, I mean, there's so many good pizza. I mean, there's a lot. It depends, you know. There's he can't so narrow it down. Yeah, he just loves it so much. Just, okay. Keep it simple. Let's keep just it the end it right keep there. The he loves pizza and chicken parm. Well, Perfect. I can't upset anyone. If I name one, then I'm upsetting, you know, Luigi. If I say, you know, it's at the it depends. Yeah. Be quiet. It's all right. All right. Well, either way, it's going to be um, an amazing issue. It actually is. We just actually flipped through it. Um, everything in here is totally amazing. New York City summer related. Hamptons. Yes. Amazing Hamptons yeah, information. Check it, yep. check it out. For sure. And uh, it's actually going to be hitting newsstands next Wednesday, actually. That's so right. where can people find it, Dan? They can find because us. Because we do get asked this question actually quite a bit. Yes. Well, there's over 600 newsstands regionally. Uh, mm -hmm. Barnes and Noble as well, uh, multiple ways. Uh, and that was one of the things we were going to talk about is a challenge being it hits newsstands next Wednesday. 
We want it's like readers, a contest. It's a contest. That's right. Right to have some readers go out there and try to uh, just you know find a copy. I try to. There's 600 locations you can. So. Yeah. So you can. So let's first tell them where they can find it, so they know. Okay. It's um we're sold at uh, 100 Barnes and Nobles um, from Boston to Washington. That's right. Um, we are also sold on an additional 600 newsstands all over the city, all over New Jersey. Pretty much if you just, you know, right. walk down the street and you see any newsstand, most likely you're gonna find a copy of Bella there. Yep. In addition, if you stay at Ocean Place Resort and Spa, which is a five-star hotel in Long Branch, right in the ocean, you'll find Bella in every guest room, right. as well as in one of my all-time favorites, Garden City Hotel in Garden City, Long Island. You'll also find Bella in all the guest rooms there too. Right. We're actually in seven hotels. Well, so exactly, it's exactly. Just those two, but exactly. Absolutely. But those are the main ones Perfect. for now. And then, um, yeah, Sabella is kind of everywhere. You can also subscribe for $10 a year. That's right. But um, pick up a copy. And we were just talking, Dan had a great yeah. idea about how to involve you guys and get some of you to our white party. That's right. Well, just to take a picture with Bella, tag it, tag the location, tag yourself, and be entered to win to a ticket into the white party. Well, more than That's one ticket, because no one tickets. wants like to be that random loser walking in by themselves. You know what I'm saying? It's That's like my right. worst nightmare. No, I'm just kidding. Mm. But um, yeah, so you know what? Whoever is out there, you could definitely find it um, in multiple states at this point. And if you're in California, you can find Camilla at Barnes & Noble throughout the state of California. That's right. So this is for either issue, guys. That's right. So That's right. go to a newsstand, see Bella, grab it, snap a pic of you holding Bella, Tag Bella um, and tell us where you saw it, and you and a friend will be entered to win uh, two VIP tickets um, into the VIP area, which most people can't even get into. Um, you can walk the red carpet with Dan and myself. Um, if that's <laughs> if none of that is exciting, um, then the we will send you a two hundred and fifty dollars beauty basket um, in lieu of the event. If for some reason you can't make the Hamptons event. But either way, um, we're excited about that. Awesome. And uh, we fun. hope you guys love the summer issue and you pick it up on a newsstand. If you want the entire list of newsstands, visit bellanyc.com. Um, on the top, it says newsstands, and there's a tab. Full list. That's Pull right. it down, and there are newsstands galore. And I promise you, you could find one near mm, you. That's right. All right? That's right. Absolutely. No, that's so great. Good. I think it's fantastic. Me too. All so right. That's fantastic. Good. So that's it. So I'm excited about everything. And uh, this, yeah, we, yeah. what? No, it's okay. Yeah, Go ahead. keep going. So we, this was just a little recap of our adventures over the past two weeks since we haven't seen you all. But um, we are in the midst of uh, booking some pretty fun uh, interviews over the next uh, four to six weeks. Um, right. Some great names, some local NYC people, as well as. Uh, celebrities from all around so we're yeah. super excited about it That's and right. a lot of great stuff coming out. a lot of great stuff and we always want to hear your guys ideas so you can always uh facebook questions here you can always email us at the office uh info at bellanyc.com yeah. and uh that's it we hope you had a great fourth of july and we will see you next week awesome thanks guys bye-bye